Welcome back. Now, every Tuesday morning, we highlight a local business in our area. That's right. So this week, we're meeting the barbershop that makes Bobby look so fresh, so clean. Certified Barbershop in Medford. I'm here with Fernando of Certified Barbershop. Fernando, appreciate you letting me be here. Thank you for coming. What was the inspiration for a Certified Barbershop? How did it come to be? Uh, certified Barbershop is was established in 2017, and uh, it was just a place that I wanted to uh, open up to give young barbers the opportunity to come work in a chill environment, uh, family-friendly uh, atmosphere, and overall just kind of a fun place to come work. How long have you been cutting hair? Um, man, I started cutting hair in 2015. Uh, professionally, um, I've always kind of had the passion for haircutting, but it was just never something that I pursued after school. So um, I started cutting hair when I was 12, um, and it just kind of grew from there. And now it's kind of like, I guess, the best choice I've ever made in my life. Why set up shop here in Medford specifically? We were in Phoenix. That's where we started uh, back in 2017. We decided that it was time to move to Medford. Um, I wanted a central location, and this is kind of right in the middle of Medford. Um, it, it's pretty cool because this has been a barber shop since 1954. And when I used to drive by here, I always look over, and it just gave me the old school barber shop feel. So I, I'm, I'm pretty stoked to be in one of the kind of older barbershops and to still keep that barbershop alive. What do you want Certified Barbershop to be known for? Uh, I love Certified Barbershop to be known for quality haircuts and just the overall uh, great experience, atmosphere. Uh, we're just four guys that love to do what we do and we just kind of come here, work, um, cut hair, hang out, and have fun. I'd like to give a shout out to Martin, uh, Paco, and Jeremy for pretty much making the team what it is. Um, I feel like without these guys, the shot wouldn't be what it is right now. 